Hey, uh, Nightmare Bonnie, Fetch took a dump in the sink again. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's my latest invention yet. <laughs> what was that about Fetch in the sink? Oh, uh, nothing. Uh, hey, what's this? Well, do you remember from a long, long time ago? When Springtrap got infected by that strange monster in the sewers. No. Uh, okay, well, never, never mind. Well, basically, we had to remove that toxin from him. And, well, you know, whenever you remove something, matter can't be created or destroyed, blah, blah, blah. It leaves behind a residue. So that's like Springtrap's, like, virus? Yes, precisely. And I've recently found a way to coagulate it into a physical form. So now we can finally act. What the heck does that mean? <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> it's alive! It's alive! What the? Ah! Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Spring trap is that? Morning, Foxy. Hey, morning, Lass. Uh, I'm tired. You're telling me. I didn't sleep very good last night. I had a feeling. Felt like I heard some crashed window last night in the middle of two in the morning or so. You're telling me. I kind of thought I was just imagining things. Maybe not. <laughs> morning, fellas. Hey, Bonnie. What's up? I'm sleepy. Oh, I'll get it! Okay, then. Ugh, I knew Bonnie liked answering the door, but geez. I know, right? He doesn't run that fast for anything. Well, besides Easter, maybe. True. Hey, uh, Foxy, there's some guy at the door, and he says he's looking for you. Hmm? I'm not expecting company. Mm. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna sit down now. Wait, someone looking for Foxy? Who the heck was at the door? I don't know, but he kind of looked like Foxy. Bonnie, are you forgetting Nightmare Foxy exists again? Or Withered Foxy. Or Mangle. Or Nightmare Mangle. Or Funtime Foxy. Or Rockstar Foxy. I can't think of any more. Yeah, me neither. Uh, hello? I heard I'm needed? Hmm. There's nobody here. Now well, that's strange. Police attack! What are you doing in my house? Nothing like some good old horseplay with your old man. Oh, my back. Huh? What, what are you talking about? I finally found ya! You finally found who? Me? What are you talking about? After all these years, I finally found ya! Son. Son? Like dad's son? Like like you did another thing with a, with a person, son? Like you had a baby, son? Yes, indeed. I didn't even think I had a dad. Well, my boy, you do now. I missed you, son. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna need some proof first. What's your name? My name is Captain Foxy the Pirate Box. I named my son right after me. It should be you. Okay, that checks out. Hmm. Who's my mom? Ah, your mother. She was the finest lass I knew. Mistress Mary of Captain Foxy. Ah, she drifted off to sea a few years ago. Such a shame. Oh. I'm sorry about that. Hi, Yist. Join her pop in David Jones' locker. Hi, the way, son. You need to know why I'm here. Wait, wait, wait. I'm still not convinced. If you're really my dad, how do we separate? Hey, that'd be a long, long time ago. We were out to sea when we were attacked by a neighboring ship. Me own crew had decided to overthrow me. Me and Mary spoke, and we decided you'd be safer on your own. We knew it'd be tough. 
we knew you'd find our way back to us someday. And I never stopped believing you were still alive out there somewhere. And lo and behold, who's standing right in front of me? Wow. That's a lot to take in. I know. But now we have to get to business, boy. How so? You see, son, I can sense a great evil along the horizon. A great monster who will destroy all of us and take these great lands. Who? By that, I'm not sure. But I know that we can get the upper hand by preparing. That's why, son, I've come to tell you. Yeah, Dad? Anything? You have superpowers. That's it. I'm done. Wait, son! No, no, no. You're just some con artist scammer trying to fool me. Go back to your Monday London church of disbelief or whatever. I don't fall for that witchcraft stuff. Son! <sighs> oh, Foxy. You were gone for a long time. What did that guy need? Ah, just some con artist trying to pull me into a scam. Well, well, that's a shame. Yeah. He had me for a second there too, but... Eh, nah, I don't believe him. So, when do we start training? Ah! Oh, hi! What are you doing here? Oh, what, you think you're gonna get rid of me that easily? Nah, my boy, I'm seeing this through to the end. Trust me, I know how you are. I know how you were raised. Those powers are lying in there somewhere. Foxy, what's this guy talking about? Okay, everyone, meet my... D allegedly, my dad. Ah, uh, you're coming along already? Ugh. Wait, your dad? Ow. I wish I had one of those. Hi. Yeah, hi, lad. I'm Bonnie. I'm Foxy's best friend. Uh, you know what? Yeah, fine. Ah, nice to meet you. And the other two? Oh, well, uh, I'm Freddy. And I'm Chica. We have one more. His name's Carl, but he's not here. What's Carl doing? Oh, he had to go pick up his prescription. Huh. Yeah, hang on a second. I thought I heard the word powers in there. Does Foxy have superpowers? Allegedly. Yes, my son was born with superpowers. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? You really think Foxy, probably the most average guy I know, was born with superpowers. <laughs> That's rich. Yeah, no offense, but if Foxy has superpowers, then something's gone wrong in the world. <laughs> I feel like I shouldn't feel offended, but yeah, Dad, there's no way I have superpowers. I mean, look at us. I'm supposedly a pirate, but all I got's an eye patch. You got that coat, and missing feet, and a hook, and that really cool hat. We hardly even look alike outside having the same name, and you probably could have just found that on the websites of the internets and stuff. Oh, trust me, boy. I know you have superpowers, and it's mostly because of your mother. Can my mom have superpowers? Well, kinda, but it would be described as superpowers to most people. You see, Something I forgot to tell you about me, Mistress Mary. She is the daughter of the Flying Dutchman. The boat? Th th no, but you guys weren't gonna recognize the name of the captain that drove the Flying Dutchman. His name was Captain Hedrick von der Decken, and he had ghostly radioactive superpowers. Or that's the modern scientific term of it. And his daughter was the one I married, and then had Foxy with. Yeah, likely story. Indeed a story, my friend, but one you'd find in the non-fiction section of the library. Okay, if Foxy supposedly has superpowers, how the heck have we not, like, seen them yet? Who knows? Maybe I have. Okay, has anybody ever seen Foxy do something weird? I got it! Foxy, try lifting me up. Okay. Okay, that's okay. <laughs> okay, okay! Uh, I don't think I have super strength. Okay, we all got superpowers of one episode, but that was also that one episode. We all lost them right afterwards. Maybe Foxy has x-ray vision. Try squinting real hard. Uh, that what? Through me. Uh, okay. Um, I'm not, I'm not getting anything. It's not, it's not working. My rib cage isn't that interesting, Foxy. Yeah, your rib cage, that's what I'm, you know what, I don't think I have x-ray vision. Yeah, listen, unless I throw Foxy in the air and he starts flying. <laughs> oh! Yeah, he ain't got superpowers, pal. No, no, no! Just think harder! Has Foxy ever done anything irregular? I'm stumped. Yeah, Dad, if I can't think of anything, then I don't have superpowers! <sighs> Wait! I remember! Oh, great. 
this! Foxy, do you remember when you did this? Oh yeah, that. Didn't Springtrap do something to me? No, 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 but that's the point. Springtrap's thing didn't give him superpowers. It just made him really, really sick. I mean, he started throwing up acid for about a month, but that didn't seem to do anything. Exactly. So what my point is, what if, for some reason, your superpowers burnt off the sickness? Bonnie, that's ridiculous. I mean, we've seen worse. Come on, let's just go talk to your dad about- Oh, wait. Is that the- is that the video? The new trailer for the brand new FNAF plush movie we're making? Wow. People should definitely go watch that. Wow. What if an iCard popped up it for right now? Okay, we're, I'm gonna stop shamelessly plugging this stuff now. Okay, Dad. So, uh, we, me and Bonnie talked it over, and I guess we kind of remember that I burned off a disease that technically should have killed me like two years ago. E, I know you had powers. You know, it's talking about the radioactive powers that are inside your veins, Foxy. My boy, I knew you could save us all. Okay, but even if I have powers, Dad, how do I access them? Well, that's why we need to train, my boy. Come on, don't worry. We'll have access to your powers in no time with a montage. Ugh. Alright guys, I'm gonna go train, I'll be back later. Bye, Foxy! Bonnie, you don't actually believe he has powers, right? Oh, come on! It'd be really cool to have a superpower friend. It's in the now, you know? It's all all the cool people are doing nowadays. I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> yes, it is! Hey, you're getting there, boy. No, Dad, I don't think I'm getting there. I'm tired, my hands hurt, my legs hurt, every part of my body just hurts. I'm tired of doing this stupid training, I don't have superpowers, and I don't want to talk about it anymore. <laughs> but boy, we're so close, I can feel it. That's what you said the last 15 minutes ago. And then the 15 minutes before that. I'm done. I'm gonna go hang out with my friends. Goodbye. <sighs> I tried my best. <gasps> hey, Foxy, did you get the superpowers yet? No, Bonnie, I didn't get the superpowers yet. I don't think I have superpowers, if I'm being honest with you. I feel like that whole thing you were talking about happened a few years back. Just some fluke. I don't have superpowers, I'm not special, I'm just a regular old fox in a regular old town. Well, happy to hear you uh, stopped chasing the dreams of that crazy old senile man. Yeah, the evidence is hard to deny, but I'm still not sure if he's my dad. Darn. I was hoping to have a cool superpowered friend. Guess I'll have to settle for a cool normal friend instead. Thanks, Bonnie. No problem. Do you guys hear that? Yeah, I do. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Is that Springtrap? Bonnie! <laughs> Oh god, ah, what are we gonna do? Ah, Foxy! Ready! You can't just stand here and do nothing!
Foxy! Wow, you're a lot smaller, though, though. Listen, I'm the same size as him, that's all that matters. Come on, Foxy, get up! Wow, wow, wow! Son, no pirate fox of mine goes down without help. <sighs> Thanks, Dad. No problem, son. Let's finish off this crib together. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Dad. No problem, son. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> 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 Oh my god, he's mush. Bonnie, Chica! Dad, Dad, are you okay? Oh, I'll be fine, son. I'll walk it off. Oh. Oh. Thanks so much, Dad, for all the help. If it weren't for you and, well, all my friends, I don't think I could have saved the day. That guy was strong. I knew I had it in you, son. You're strong. I knew that from the first moment I saw you again. Mm, thanks, Dad. <laughs> Who are those creeps? Hmm? Oh, God, that's such short notice. I didn't even have time to put pants on. Let me find another swear pants. <laughs> you see, I didn't laugh with my mouth open. And that's how much I spit on you. Didn't make it that far. Either way, how did you like our disgusting monster spring trap we made in our lab? <laughs> oh, he's dead. Wow. We didn't even get the chance to see the fight. Oh, damn. Oh, hey, Foxy, nice glow. Thanks. Oh, wait, so which one of you made that? <laughs> I did, you know, just trying my best here. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, dear. <laughs> that was for me, Pop. Oh, ooh, oh, ha ha, oh, that's so funny, oh my god. Shut up, Mango. Oh. You said it, Nightmare Chica. <laughs> I'm dying in the floor. <laughs> Hey, does anybody hear that? Hmm? What are you talking about, Foxy? Oh no. <laughs> There's another one! Uh, Freddy, I don't think that's what Foxy is concerned about. Oh no. Well, it's nice to finally meet you all. 
Ha, 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 ha,